This took a whole piece out of us. A whole piece out of us. Thank you for joining us this Sunday evening. A family grieving. It has been more than a week since 21 year old Elijah Wheeler was shot and killed. Nine on your sides. Jake Ryle was at the vigil where a community is coming together to remember his life. Jake. Well, it was certainly a very emotional vigil. The father of a son killed by gun violence grabbed me by the arm and sobbed before the event. Now his son with a nickname of Thunder, he hopes will carry on a roaring legacy. When you see that on the news or see the yellow tape up, it's a lot deeper than that. You got the ripple effect. You got grandmothers, mothers, fathers, kids. Mothers funny like Latrice Rogers. Serious. Man of the household. Man run everything. He think he the oldest and he got an older brother. It's just so much. And fathers like Elijah Wheeler Sr. Another nickname he had called Thunder. And I ain't got to worry about what they called him there because he roar like me. Their son, 21 year old Elijah Wheeler, shot and killed near Borden and Weber Streets more than a week ago. Elijah is still with us. Sunday. It'll be times when we can hear his laughter. Dozens locking hands in prayer. Would help bind us back together. For Mitch Morris. Hello. Another memorial less than a block away. And as we were standing over there by the church over there, it kind of took me back and it was it was the same type of hurt and pain. Nearly nine years ago to the day, 16 year old Mark Hooten. On his way to work, got shot and killed down there. The balloons, the cookout, the prayer vigil. Morris still battling the same issue he was nearly a decade ago. Still fighting the fight. You know, we, we can't stop. It's, it's, it's a mission. He's hoping outreach programs like the Phoenix program through Cincinnati Works will curb the violence and save a life down the road. I just didn't think it would happen to me or my family, but it did. So we just trying to take it one day at a time. And Kalia English has been charged with murder in the shooting death of Elijah Wheeler. He's due in court August 10th. Jake Ryle, 9 on your side.